this next one is a heel hook. If I'm in his guard, what I want to do is first of all keep my face back so I'm not getting kicked or punched in the face. I want to get this knee in. That's keeping his guard open. This other leg is back from my base so I'm not getting swept or kicked over. Next thing I want to do is I want to get this leg so it's underneath. It's keeping his ankle up for me. This is going on the front of his knee. This arm should just really be defending this leg just to prevent him from trying to trip me. So I just grab the ankle like this. What I want to do is all in one motion. I want to put my foot right here, right between, right his butt, and I want to throw myself backwards. As I do that, I want to bring this leg over nice and tight. This has to be flat on the ground. If it's up, I'm going to get, I'm going to be, it's going to be a ankle lock, heel hook war. So I don't want to do that. This wants to go right here, tuck it real nice and tight. What I want to do now, keep my legs, my knees nice and tight. I want to rotate my body. It's right here for me. Get the grip here. What I want to do is I don't want to just turn because then that will allow him to turn with me. What I want to do is as soon as I get the heel hook here, all I do is extend my hips up just like that. I'm just raising my hips up. Okay. I'm going to keep this here. I'm defending from getting kicked in the face. I want to keep my head back. Just keeping his ankle up here. This goes to his butt. Sit back. Get the foot to the ground. Grab the heel. Knees have to be squeezed tight. That's going to trap his leg. Rotate my body straight and raise my hips. Just like, okay, this is, this is the technique in full speed.